Ahoy! Welcome to Adventure. Howdy, y'all. Welcome to Adventures with Kendo. Today, we're gonna go see the Redondo Pier. Now, this is not your usual pier that goes straight out to the sea. This is something completely unique. So join me as we explore the Redondo Pier. Ahoy! Welcome to Adventures with Kendall. I'm Kendall, and this is Redondo Pier. This is the Redondo Pier. It was one of several from 1889 to about 1993 that were built together into one. What's the most unique feature about this particular pier is that it's a horseshoe pier. Now, what is a horseshoe pier? I'm glad you asked. Basically, instead of the standard pier that goes straight out of the ocean, this one is a continuous loop. And this particular pier was actually completed in 1993 with others attached to it. The Redondo Pier started out as a disjointed group of wharves near the end of the 20th century, but it evolved into an interconnected structure after a series of storms and demolitions throughout the 20th century. The pier area was heavily used by tourists and locals during the 1970s, but declined after the nearby Seaport Village project failed and went into bankruptcy in 1984. In 1988, the pier was severely battered by two winter storms and on May 27th, it burned to the waterline due to an electrical circuit. The fire was so severe and so large that a SIG alert was announced for the San Diego freeway several miles away. The pier's modern reinforced concrete version was completed in 1995 and has brought back the appeal to Redondo Beach's business district ever since. Welcome to Portside Cafe. Now we're here because it's a great place to eat out here in Redondo Pier. Now, you see I have just a burger, meal, and fries. That's not all they have. They also have a pastrami, which my wonderful cameraman has and also other meals, including a kid's menu. If you have kids, they'll love the menu. I guarantee it. Now let's head to the lower docks of the Redondo Pier. Here we'll see the amazing boats that people have here, as well as the other activities you can do around here. Come on, let's go check out this place. This here is the docks, but there are more restaurants and gift shops along the strand. You want a paddle boat or a surf? There's a paddle house right behind me. You'll have some great fun out here. Now let's head over here and learn about the marina and Kings Harbor. That includes the construction of this jetty. A jetty is a large seawall meant to prevent large waves, such as those from a tsunami, from crashing into the boats or other structures along the pier. Boy, I had a great time at the Redondo Pier. But now, let's get into our boat and head back to the studio. This was my first time on a horseshoe pier, and there were a lot of things to see there. That burger, mmm, that was a good burger. The pier is also great for fishing and shopping. I highly recommend going on there when you're in the area. Well, that's the end of the show. See you later, folks, and may your gifts bless the world. 